This is a $17 tackle box. I just bought these tackle boxes and I ran them over with a truck to test their durability. And yeah, I'm so serious. Do you guys exchange these? Go ahead and drop a comment down below and let me know if you want this box, okay? But the comment is gonna let me know that you are entered to win this box. I'll pick a winner in like two weeks. What's up guys, it's TJ, <laughs> AKA Fishing with Yag Pack, and I'm here today with my good friends, Fishing with Norm. We got Hunter, what's your channel name exactly? The Hunter Fisher. The Hunter Fisher, that's right. And we've got Zade. We're here today in the Dick's parking lot, as you can see. And uh, I saw a video, right? I saw a video the other day on Instagram from your boy, Lunkers TV, okay? Now he posted something on his story and it really got the gears spinning, okay? Now I wanna see for myself. What I saw could not be faked, okay? It just, it could not be faked, right? So I'm gonna put it to the test myself today. Guggen Squad tackle boxes versus Plano boxes uh, and I'm also going to throw into the mix another, maybe like a Flambeau or whatever other brand I can find here in Dick's. But we've actually been riding around earlier today. Where's Norm? Like, is he just, oh, he's chilling. There he is. All right, everybody good? Everybody good? All right, now we're going to go in here. We're going to try, hopefully they have all the tackle boxes that we need, but we're going to basically, like I said, buy one Guggen one, uh, which is made by Bass Mafia. Then we're going to buy a Plano one, which is quite expensive. I'm not going to lie. Those are expensive tackle boxes. So is it going to stand up to the test? I don't know. We're going to find out together. We're actually going to bring these tackle boxes out here in this parking lot and run them over Rewards. in Norm's free truck. Free Planet Fitness, Black Card. <laughs> Yo, hey. Yeah. That might be free yours. Membership. I wonder if it works. Free games. Watch it actually work. Free Anyways, all right. It. I get it, Let's get inside. All right, so we just got here in the fishing section. And actually, this is a... It's quite full. Last time I was here with Norm, Norm was making a video, and it was not this full. So it's very full. Good on you. All right, let's... Oh, no. We're doing a video on these one time. We you got to rocket you fishing. Run it here? You won't run yeah, they it. Got, the rocket they got, they fishing got six run? of them, and they're on clearance. Hey, two thousand likes. Pop all of them. Come on, Yak Squad. <laughs> all all right, so here we go. Check this out. Okay, so we've got. I think that might be the price. I'm not hundred percent sure, but this is a seventeen dollar tackle box. Okay, so every fisherman needs a tackle box, right? All right, so we've got a tackle box right here, and this is the one that. Uh, this is the one that's not supposed to break. So we're gonna. Run it over with Norm's truck. Norm's got like 38s on his truck too. I don't he's, know what they are, but he's sitting big. in a, it's like 31s. Kind of. But he's sitting on he's sitting on a monster truck, so I don't know if it's gonna break or not. I, honestly, I have no idea. So all right, now we got the Plano Edge boxes. How much are these? 25 bucks. Okay, these. This is actually what am I doing in my life where I I go to the store, I buy stuff just to break it. Like that's okay. like YouTube life, right there. Okay, that's so you gonna you get a. You could seriously buy these for 20 bucks instead. Would that be the same effect? Or do you want Well, the they're not the same size box, oh, okay. which I don't want there to be any discrepancies yeah. in. This, this would change. Being, this would change it. Yeah, Good. You know, I just don't want there to be any okay. discrepancies. Okay, now. What I did not see in that video on Instagram was another tackle box. So, like another brand. Just actually, here they are in my face right here. Sweet. So, I did not see where they. So, we have one Plano. We have one of the Guggens already. Is that is that the same one? Some, I don't think so. All right, so we've got one Guggen one made by Bass Mafia. We've got one Plano Edge, and we're gonna grab one of the same size right here. Seven dollar uh, Flambo box. That's the same size, right? Yeah, the same size box. Okay, so these are the three most common tackle boxes now now we're gonna run them over with the truck <laughs> now we're gonna run them over with the truck <laughs> now we uh now we go pay for them i think that's all uh, that's Dude, how much do you think these are combined what do you mean like how much do you think all the tackle boxes are combined that's 24 dollars. that's 17 dollars, and that's seven dollars dang this so is... like what 30 bucks in total yeah no he you tricked me okay <laughs> <I'm kidding. laughs> hold on, hold on. so this one this one's 7.99 right this one's uh, eight bucks 25 bucks 18 dollars now when you buy a tackle box, right? Every fisherman generally needs a tackle box, right? I mean, some fishermen like smaller tackle boxes like myself, because I run around with like a small backpack, but like Norm has a boat, right? He just got a boat. He traded the fishing reel for a boat. I don't know how he did that, but <laughs> Norm needs a tackle box, right? Zaid needs a tackle box. Hunter needs a tackle box. Everybody needs a tackle box, right? Now, we're gonna put it to the test like, we're gonna give, we're gonna give a little endurance test. Maybe a, maybe a stress test. That's what we'll call it, stress test. We're gonna waterboard some tackle boxes. Now, uh, Norm actually, Norm told me before we came in here that he's gonna pay for those for you. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> this all right, man. We're good, we're good. We're we good. got That's the boxes, we, we, we got the goods. We need one Bass Mafia box, one Plano, and one And we're just box. running all these over with a truck. We're literally just gonna run them over. I'm gonna, I'm probably gonna, 
That's what you normally do when you get a tackle box. To make sure it's good, you run it over with the truck. And then if that works, then you throw it in the propellers of a helicopter and see if it lasts in. And then if it does, you're good. Your so speed worms are protected. what you're saying is, step two to this video, secure a helicopter. We'll see you guys in the parking lot. I got one in my backyard. Up. I got two of them, actually. Helicopter? Yeah. Really? Oh, dude, let's go. All right, guys, go ahead. While we're on the way to check out, drop your comments down in the comments section. Before we even get outside, don't cheat either. Which box do you think is going to be able to stand up to the test of being run over by Norm's massive F1? So, what happens when I break one of these and the piece of plastic goes straight into my tire? Then I'll have to buy you a tire, I guess. Dude. All right, that's all I had to hear. We have a verbal agreement on camera. <laughs> so, if my truck, if something could break on my truck, it will. And yeah, in fact, I drove five hours to Bass, or five minutes to Bass Pro Shops to meet Hunter, take a picture, parking brake was on. That's Emergency brake was on. Here. Yeah, and it smelled like fire. Hey, that'll fit <laughs> underneath the tire problem, so I'm saying. Yeah, it'll be okay. Let's yeah. check out. Let's True. check out and run over some tackle boxes. <laughs> I just paid forty-four dollars for some tackle boxes that we're fixing to run over. Yep. Let's do it. That literally is the definition of a waste of money. But actually no, because it's for a science experiment. Yes. Science. We're science doing it for science. Isn't free. Science isn't science. Free. science you heard it here first. Experience. We've got the first tackle box. Under the tire, okay. Now, what does Norm got? Norm looks. These are like 38s on 24s, maybe 52s, 26s. I think. 52s, yeah, 52 super oh, I swampers. They were 110s. But uh, so we're gonna run this run this tackle box over. So this is a, a Mike Iconelli approved flambo. I'll show you guys. That rock is like. This is a brand new Mike like Iconelli something. approved flambo tough trainer. Let's just find out how tough it actually is. I'm just gonna rest it. All the boxes. I'm doing the same exact thing. I'm gonna rest it right there. Okay. Should I, should I like? No, just don't don't gun it. Just I go. back up. <laughs> just take it. Just put it in no, drive. You, so all you want me to do is just put it in drive and slowly yeah, run over. It, yeah, just creep over. Put okay. it in drive. And, and my over. rims are dirty. Sorry, everybody. My truck hasn't had a bath. I mean, it is. It's Florida, dude. It's raining. Yeah. It's you know. You're driving the clay. So I'll tell you what we'll do. We're gonna do this box first. All right. Because that was the cheapest of go, all. Yeah, level. go to cheapest to most expensive. I think that's what that's exactly what we'll do. We'll go cheapest to most expensive. So we'll do that one right there. We'll do the Guggen one next, or Guggen Bass Mafia, and then we'll do the yeah. uh, the Plano. Like I do said, we think? I think this is gonna break for seven dollars. My vote is break. Okay. Hunter, do you have a vote? I, it's a hundred percent gone. <laughs> that thing's that thing's gonna be shreds. By all time right, I think it's gonna break too. I think it's gonna break too. All right, and if my tires break, you got me. Yeah, yeah, yeah I'll buy you a new tire. All right, let's go. But if your tires break to that plastic, like, you might need new you tires might, anyway. Might just have some bitch made tires. <laughs> like, no, go in, but it's gonna be blurred out. Oh, oh, oh. It's Wait, already broke. Should I put it in sport mode or leave it? I think you'll be good. Not in sport Act mode. Go ahead sport and put it in sport mode. Just sport case. mode. Sport mode, yeah. sport mode, just in case. I'm actually kind of excited to watch this. Oh, maybe we need, maybe we need, uh, hand me my glasses on that side of your truck over there, up top. Oh yeah, just in case something flies yeah, out Yeah, because I ain't trying to get, you know, popped in the, so I gotta, I gotta get close in there, you know? I gotta, we gotta get in there All to make right, sure. Go All right, you're good. Send in. Oh. Oh. Pieces. It's in pieces, dude. It's destroyed. Without looking, that did not sound like it survived. That was in pieces. I knew it. Destroyed. Okay, now don't don't sweat. All right, don't sweat, guys. Don't sweat. I know you're sweating. We're gonna clean this mess up. We're not gonna leave this oh. mess out in the parking lot. I promise. Yep. It's got. All right, yeah, next up, Flex Seal. Flex Seal. <laughs> All right, let me put this down for just one second. Next up on uh, the the break it list is the uh, the Guggen Squad one here. Let's let me grab I'm gonna grab some of these pieces real quick. Next up on the uh, the list, the Guggen Squad slash Bass Mafia tackle box. Now, we ready? I'm ready. I'm actually gonna wait. I'm not sure. All right, well, I'll tell you guys right now, on the Instagram video, it didn't break. Glasses on, safety first. I think it might break. Are right, you ready? Yep, you got it. That sounded like it broke. Yeah, just a little bit. Oh. It broke. <laughs> Bro. Okay. So, the Guggen Squad one that I saw on Instagram that didn't break. Are we sure it's the right one though? You know what I mean? Like maybe that's not the truck approved one. I don't know. It looked just like that one, so. Well, I don't think this one was supposed to break. I don't know. That's why we do these things. What is the true 
toughest tackle box. I would have. I thought that thing was gonna. I thought it was gonna be good. I did too. I'm not gonna lie, I did too. I saw it on Instagram. That's why we're testing it here because yep. I saw it on Instagram. So. All right, Plano. Now this is the most expensive. This is a twenty-five dollar box. I, I hate running these over, dude. Like, <laughs> I want to keep the tackle boxes. <laughs> Twenty-five dollar tackle. That's a lot box. of money for science. It is for science. Bill Nye would be proud. Yeah. Actually, fun fact: Bill Nye actually is my uncle. So. This man's Bill Nye is my uncle. Plano box. Here we go. This one's like kind of sketch about this. Everyone one. Lined up? Yeah, you're good. Oh yeah, that didn't even last. I told you that was gonna do that. That did not even last two seconds. That one broke the fastest. That one literally broke the fastest. Okay. So. How are you supposed to keep your Cinco's in these things, man? Rip to the. Uh, now rip? I know that was. That was kind of a. Um, that was kind of... I've seen that one get run over by a truck before, so I kind of had a feeling that was going to happen. Hunter played a little joke on me, guys. Hunter, he's a, he's a trickster, right? He's a trickster. He said... It's my fault. You got the wrong box after I broke the other ones. So, <laughs> here we are, again, in the, uh, the Dick's parking lot. We're going to go buy the correct tackle box now. Okay, so, I goofed. I bought the wrong tackle box. It happens. It's not a big deal. Let's, uh, let's come in here. Let's get the correct tackle box, because... I guess it's, from the looks of this video, I just like wasted money, I guess. But all right, this one does feel very uh, sturdy and durable. So I'm not, let's just, let's just go straight out to the truck and run it over. Obviously, well, let's pay for it first and then go to the truck and run it over. We've got a $28 tackle box right here. This is the, uh, the green and black. Uh, you know what we're going to do? We're this just going to send it. We're just going to send it. Are you ready send to send her. It? Send this her. <laughs> We're going straight, no cuts, straight from the store, right here, right here, right now. Should we do it next one? Nope, right here. Right here, right now. Can you grab this date so you don't yeah, fly gotcha. away? Yeah, right. right next. If that thing busts and hits a Mustang, it ain't gonna do it. It ain't gonna, it ain't gonna do it. There, we're good to go. Back right. up. Sport mode, three-wheel drive, same thing? Uh, yeah. Straight send it. Dude, I want to see this. Uh-oh. I'm excited. Just literally straight back. Ready? Yep. Back up. Okay. Just go, go until you feel it like. Ooh. <laughs> what is this? Oh. Not a scratch. Not no cracks, no nothing. Wow. Dang. That's you, absurd. Wait, that check the clips. Absurd. Check the clips. Check the clips. Yeah, yeah open the clips. Uh, open the clips. Open this. Okay, clips. Oh, it still clips good. Yep, still clips perfectly fine. You want to take the yeah yeah off? take it off take it off. We just I wanted no cut straight from the store to oh, be strong strong. <laughs> Whoa, you don't with it. Okay, maybe I should actually just cut this thing. There you go. All right, let's see. Let's see what the inside looks like. Make sure ain't nothing missing. Well, there's a little something. Is that? That's okay. not. Doesn't green. count though. I guess that it would be green if it was. You know. Yeah, what it saying? looks like it's from production. I don't yeah, know. from a milk site. Oh, okay. But hey. It passed the test. It passed the vibe check, baby. It passed there the we test. Go. It broke a lot of stuff. Yeah. It just cost me seventy dollars to figure out that this tackle box <laughs> was the the non-breakable, runoverable tackle box. Now, so here we have a twenty-five dollar Plano box, right? Destroyed. Here we have a uh, twenty-five dollar Plano box, twenty-eight dollar uh, Bass Mafia in collaboration with Guggen Squad box absolutely nothing wrong with it and this thing i don't know feels more sturdy than me if i was in the market for a tackle box and i wanted something that was going to last a long time you, you know where my money is all right and my money is in a lot of broken tackle boxes trial and error as we like to call it here on fishman the pack now who wants this box okay because i technically don't need this box right so if you're if you're watching this video still at this point thank you number one number two Go ahead and drop a comment down below and let me know if you want this box, okay? And if you do, all you have to do to be entered to win this box, be subscribed to the channel and like this video. That's literally all you gotta do. Drop the comment. The comment is gonna let me know that you are entered to win this box. I'll pick a winner in like two weeks, probably right before Christmas. So it'd be a nice little Christmas gift for you to put all of your new Christmas fishing lures that you get. Now, let's see if they'll take this back. So I got a question, my man. I just bought these tackle boxes and I ran them over with a truck to test their durability. And I'm so serious. Do you guys exchange these? I just, I, I ran them over. 
just now. <laughs> okay, well, yeah, make sure you let them know that when you go in there. Okay, I'll let them know. Yeah, I mean, the, the, the return policy is 60 days, so. Alright. Yeah. So I just, I just bought these. Yeah. Just now. Yeah. And I ran them over in the parking lot just to make sure, like I was testing the durability. You guys exchanging? I don't think so. Alright. 